All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. I'm just going to do a video on uh, giving each one of these dongles their own serial number. I know a lot of people come across this problem using multiple dongles with the same Pi or computer. So I just figured I'd try to do something here simple wise. But uh, as you can see, I just took a label maker and put 101, 102, 103 because I'm going to and I'm going to change the serial number to match my label here. So if I have multiple one of these plugged into a USB hub or whatnot, uh, I could tell which one is what and if which one's giving me a problem if I have a problem. So or if which one's not showing up on Windows or Linux. So what I'm going to do is plug these into a hub and plug them into my Windows computer to show an easy way of uh, how to uh, use HD SDR to see your uh, all your serial numbers and stuff. There's other ways to do it, but we'll do it that way. And uh, you can do the same thing with like SDR Sharp. Because these all end with uh, zero, 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 and so on. So, uh, like I said, we want to change these to match the label. So, I'll be right back at the computer to show that. All right, now we're back. Now, I'm on my Windows computer here. And what we are going to do is bring up HD SDR. Now, you don't have to. I'm just going to do this to just show uh the rtls that i have plugged in so i have all three of them plugged in so we're just going to stop that and click on that guy and as you can see we have three here with the same thing so we don't know which one's which which one we're using so let's fix that so we can uh let that go so what we're going to do now is i'm going to plug my USB hub into my uh, Raspberry Pi so we can see these on it. So now that we have that plugged in, and if we do this again, as you can see, they're still there, but if we shut this down and bring it back up, we can uh, see that we don't have one. So there we go. So now that we don't have none, <clears throat> so we can close that down again. All right, so here on the Pi, we can go ahead and if we type in, let's see here. As you can see, we have three dongles plugged in with the uh, seven zeros and one one for the serial number. So what we are going to do is, I'm gonna unplug two of them. So if we rerun this, pr this again, as you can see, we only see one now. So the one I have plugged in is the 103. So what we are going to do is we're going to change the last three to 103. And since we're on device zero, device zero, dash S, then your zeros, then we're going to put a 103. Then we're going to do that. We're going to say Y for yes. All right. So that should be good. So let's go ahead, turn that guy off. We'll plug in my other one. And this is a 102. So we're going to do 102. As you can see, current is one. We're going to say yes, change it to 102. All right. So let's plug in the last one. And that guy should be 101. So we'll do a 101. As you can see, default is one. Changing it to a 101, we'll say yes. 
All right, so now what we can do is <clears throat> let me plug my USB hub back into my computer here and we'll bring up HDSDR again. RTL stop click on that guy oh let me turn these on let me get out of this again And there we go. Now I'm not quite sure why it didn't change the one. That might be because I didn't re-plug it back in. So let's try that again. Because since I'm using a powered hub, it's staying powered all the time. And the other ones were not powered on. So let's see if that fixes my issue here. And there we go. That fixed the issue. So that was on my end. So anyway, as you can see now, we're at 101, 102, 103. So now since my RTLs are labeled, I know exactly which one I'm using. And uh, we don't get mixed up, confused. And if we have an issue with one, we know exactly which one to go to to be replaced or whatever the issue may be so hopefully this helps out uh thanks for watching stay tuned for another one and don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe